at Six Flags Magic Mountain. It is day number two of Oktoberfest. We came yesterday for Fright Fest but didn't get to eat. We're gonna head inside. You can purchase the items individually at the individual booths or buy a tasting card. They're $39, $49, or $59. They each come with six tastes. If you do the $49, you get one plastic beer stein, and the $59.99, you get two. Let's go eat. This stuff is the best stuff I've eaten in a very long time. <laughs> First booth closest to Justice League, we have the German meatballs. They are pork and beef meatballs served with mashed potatoes and a creamy caper sauce. Next up we have the Bavarian chicken on a stick. It is a seasoned chicken thigh on a stick served with mashed potatoes and lemon wedge, although I do not see a lemon wedge. And then we have the Sauerbraten, which is a German pot roast, slow cooked marinated beef roasted served over mashed potatoes. So these are the three main food items for the first booth, and they also had a cinnamon roll and some coleslaw. <laughs> first item are the meatballs. Mm. Ooh. The mashed potatoes are delicious. The creamy caper is good, and those meatballs are really tasty. Mm. I'd say this one's a definite plus. I'm with Nick and he already dug into this. This is the pot roast with the mashed potatoes. Our first piece was a little fatty, but this piece is really lean and it is super flavorful. Oh, and that caper sauce. Look, there's actually capers in the mashed potatoes. Capers in the sauce, not the mashed potato. That's good, put capers on anything. There is like a slightest breeze and breath of air, otherwise it is like 200 degrees out here today. Next up is the chicken skewer. Now it is chicken thigh meat. Typically I like chicken breast, but let's give it a try. Mmm. <laughs> That's actually really good. It also comes with the mashed potatoes. From the middle booth, we have the beer cheese mac. It is macaroni with beer cheese, and they're telling me there's bacon inside. I don't see it, but they said that's where it is. <laughs> then we have the beer cheese spatzel egg noodles covered with beer cheese and topped with tri-tip. Oh, no, sorry, that's this one. That's this one. And then the tri-tip poutine. It is seasoned kettle chips topped with tri-tip, cheese curds, and brown gravy. There's the mac. Let's give it a try. <laughs> Ooh, that beer cheese is creamy. Mm, wow. That is rich, but tasty. I don't see the bacon. <laughs> the team member even said he asked, and he said the bacon was in it, but I don't see the bacon, but the mac and cheese is good. Just imagine what it Here's the beer cheese spatzel with the tri-tip. Oh, wow. Isn't that good? That's wrong. <laughs> Whoops, the tri-tip's falling off. Let me do this. So it is the same beer cheese on the spatzel as the mac and cheese. Nick said that's wrong. It's, that's definitely a guilty pleasure. <laughs> you need to go up the hill to uh, Superman like three times after you eat that, but that is good. Here's the poutine with the cheese curds. If you love cheese curds, I love fried cheese curds. Uh, full throttle sports bar up front. The best fried cheese curds, even better than at the fair. So this is kettle chips with the cheese curds, a little bit of brown gravy on there, and the tri-tip again. Let's dig in. This is a good sized portion too. You know, I always say people don't think of Magic Mountain as being a culinary destination. Their taco and beer fest they did earlier this year for the first time, food was amazing. The flavors of the world that they wrapped up during summer, some of the best food festival food I had anywhere. And we did uh, this event. Oh, is the bacon down there? Oh, the bacon's at the bottom. 
Oh, that's the spatzel. Oh. Never mind, never mind. <laughs> but uh, the flavor of the world, some of the best food. And we did this last year, and the food was really good. It was inside of Asa Club, so no complaints about the food festival food here at Magic Mountain at all. Yeah. How's that, Nick? <laughs> this stuff is the best stuff I've eaten in a very long time. <laughs> it's really good. They just made the Fright Fest announcement, too, for 7 o'clock. The zombies and ghouls will be coming out. variety of different tasting cards we'll go over with you, but one comes with a single plastic stein. I got the Sam Adams Oktoberfest. From the booth closest to Asa Clubs, they have a bratwurst on a stick or a spicy bratwurst on a stick. I got the spicy. Then they had a pretzel with beer cheese or a pretzel bites with beer cheese. And I'm digging this, like German pop music playing in the background. <laughs> there is a band ready to perform, the same band that was driving Mama crazy up at Katie's Kettle. There spicy bratwurst and it's really funny because I don't eat a lot of red meat I say that in every video but every food fest I find myself eating more and more red meat as people are switching over to vegan and vegetarian I find myself eating more meat but here we go let's get oh give it a side of spicy mustard you can put on too much mustard oh yeah it's got a kick but it's pretty good and the mustard's really good too that's a staple right oh yeah it's spicy <laughs> Totally spicy. Actually, the sun just went down. Where did the sun go? But I'm not complaining. Nick is cutting the spicy sauce. Uh, is this bratwurst. real meat? Yeah, it's real spicy. It's real sausage. Yeah, or bratwurst. Oh, it's bulky. Yeah, it's good. And it has a kick. Yeah. And then you try the mustard. The mustard is good too. Love shine. Uh, what's the song? No deny, no let your love shine. What's the words? I don't know the words. I know the song. I don't know the words. Let your love shine, let your love shine. I don't know all the words, but I know this is let your love go. Is that what it is? Uh -huh. So let your love... What is the words? Comment below. <laughs> Booth closest to Asa Clubs has a kielbasa, a frankfurter, and a bratwurst with your choice of grilled peppers and onions or sauerkraut. And they also have German potato salad and apple strudel. I ordered a bratwurst and a kielbasa, no, a frankfurter and a kielbasa, and nobody knew what the difference was between the three. They couldn't figure it out. So I'm like, you know what, just give me the apple strudel. So we got some sort of sausage product with uh, peppers and onions and the German potato salad over here, which we've had last year, it's really good, and the apple strudel on a stick. This is the mystery sandwich. It's got a snap. What would have a snap? The frankfurter, the kielbasa, or the frankfurter? The frankfurter, I don't know. We need my dad for this. This is my dad's food. Actually, no, bratwurst would have a snap. Bratwurst would have a snap, but the other one, did the other one? I don't know. Whatever it is, it comes on the bun. The bun's really good. The peppers and onions with the mustard are delicious. So whatever this ended up being, <laughs> kind of a surprise, is actually pretty good. Is that good? <laughs> so we went to Pump, Lisa Vanderpump's restaurant on the closing night and got the absolute last serving ever of her world famous potato salad. And it was good, but let's give this one a try. This was good. Mm -hmm. vinegary taste. Mm -hmm. Lisa's was cold. This is a warm, like vinegary potato salad. I don't know, Lisa Vanderpump. I didn't know. Magic Mountain, I think, got you beat with the potato salad. <laughs> this is a lot cheaper, too. Actually, no, this is more money than Pump was. This is actually more money than Pump. Mm. My recommendation is get the spicy bratwurst on a stick from the one booth and get the potato salad from the other, because that is good. German chocolate cake <laughs> and pretzel ice cream. This is a salted caramel ice cream with pretzel bites on the top. Oh my. That is so moist. 
Wow, that is good. But there's no way we can finish this now. So I'm probably just gonna take it home, but that is. I'll have some in the container for later and some I'm smushed into my pants for later. It is so hot the camera overheated and the phone overheated. So that is it. <laughs> I've overheated, Nick is overheated. Uh, what are we gonna say? Oh, that is it for Oktoberfest at Six Flags Magic Mountain Run. Select days through Halloween. The food was delicious. Everything yeah. was so good. What was your favorite? I know what it is, but I'm gonna ask you. The mac and cheese and the one the egg noodles. The, the uh, spatzel. Spatzel. The and uh, potato salad was pretty good. Yeah, the potato salad, the spicy bratwurst, everything was absolutely delicious. Yeah. The only thing, the pretzel could have been a little bit fresher, but everything, like every, we tried every single item, or at least every version of it. There wasn't one bad thing, yeah. Much. The desserts were good. The favorite was probably the chocolate cake, then the ice cream, then maybe the apple strudel, and we didn't, the only thing we didn't try was the cinnamon roll, but everything else was delicious. So if you liked the video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button with the notification bell turned on, and follow us on social media at the Funnel Cake Blog. We'll see you soon. See you later. Bye.